Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to forget sleek matte black or the imposing gray we're used to seeing on fighter jets. The US Navy's F-35C Lightning II has taken on a whole new deadly chrome look that's turning heads of the aviation world. This isn't just some flashy makeover. This chrome coating is a closely guarded secret by the US Navy. Is it a new form of stealth technology? A test bed for future aircraft materials? Or simply a bold aesthetic statement? Join us as we reveal the potential implications of this radical departure from traditional fighter jet appearances. Let's get started. Before this chrome coating became the hot topic in the aviation community, similar coatings have been observed on F-35s used by the VX-9 Vampires, a squadron known for conducting tests. However, this particular F-35 belongs to VFA-125, the Rough Raiders, a fleet replenishment squadron known for their high operational tempo on carriers. This suggests a shift from experimental coatings tested by the VX-9 Vampires to practical use in operational settings. Stealth technology revolves around remaining undetected and hidden. Like a stealthy predator, these aircraft remain unseen until it's too late. The F-22 Raptor, F-35 Lightning, and the legendary F-117 Nighthawk all utilize low observable technology to achieve this. The F-117 Nighthawk, in particular, made history during the First Gulf War when Iraqi forces experienced firsthand the impact of being taken by surprise. The Nighthawk's design incorporated radar-absorbing materials coatings and a shape that minimized radar returns, making it extremely difficult to detect. Its ram coatings were black, and coupled with its preference for night missions, earned it the nickname Nighthawk. The next leap in stealth technology came with the F-22 Raptor, a stealth aircraft capable of operating in both day and night conditions. Building upon this legacy, the F-35 Lightning further improved methods for applying and maintaining these critical ram coatings on its surface. These advancements have cemented the reputation of these aircraft as low observable and minimally visible to radar detection. Well, these chrome-like coatings and departure from the conventional stealth aesthetics has sparked speculation about the motivation behind these unconventional exteriors. One theory points to the growing influence of passive systems like infrared search and track IRST. Unlike traditional radar-based detection, IRST systems, such as those employed by the Russian Su-27 flanker, rely on telescopic lenses and infrared cameras to visually track targets. This shift in detection methods poses a new challenge to fifth-generation aircraft, as it emphasizes the importance of visual stealth over radar invisibility. The mirror-like coatings observed on these aircraft could signify a strategic response to the threat posed by IRST systems. By adopting a reflective exterior, these aircraft might be aiming to blend seamlessly into their surroundings, effectively rendering themselves invisible to visual detection. This development mirrors the tactics of a fictional alien predator in a popular sci-fi film, where the creature uses its environment to remain undetected. It is a concept that seems to be influencing real-world stealth strategies. Notably, the presence of these coatings on an F-35 aircraft engaged in carrier operations suggests that this technology is being tested in one of the most challenging environments for aircraft that is the corrosive, saltwater-laden atmosphere of the open sea. This deployment underscores the significance of these developments in the ongoing evolution of stealth technology. When it comes to combat tactics, a fleet replenishment squadron like VFA-125 may not be at the front line, but it plays a crucial role aboard carriers, serving as a vital intermediary step towards outfitting operational squadrons with advanced technologies. These squadrons are integral to the Navy's efforts to develop the next generation air dominance fighter, known as the FAXX, which is poised to be a game changer in aerial warfare. One of the key aspects being tested on current F-35s, including newer coatings, is their effectiveness in countering infrared search and track systems, which are passive and pose a challenge to traditional radar jamming methods used in electronic warfare. This emphasis on countering IRST systems falls within the broader framework of all spectral warfare, highlighting the evolving nature of modern aerial combat. The F-35C's story stretches back to the Cold War era, where the need for a versatile, multi-role fighter aircraft for the U.S. Navy became evident. Several competing programs emerged in the 1980s and 1990s, including the Advanced Tactical Fighter, and the Naval Advanced Tactical Fighter. These programs aim to develop aircraft with superior stealth, agility, and sensor capabilities to counter emerging Soviet threats. In 1993, the U.S. Department of Defense decided to merge these programs into a single ambitious project, 
the Joint Strike Fighter, JSF, program. The goal was to create a common fighter platform for all branches of the U.S. military, with variants tailored to the specific needs of each service. This ambitious undertaking aimed to save costs, streamline development, and ensure interoperability between different units. The JSF program has been plagued by development delays, cost overruns, and technical challenges. The complexity of designing and building a common platform for different services, coupled with ambitious performance goals, led to numerous hurdles. Despite these challenges, the program has persevered, and the F-35C finally achieved initial operational capability in 2019. The F-35C's new appearance has been attributed to the use of an advanced stealth coating known as HVARP, or Highly Vulnerable Aircraft Radar Paint. This state-of-the-art paint is designed to absorb and scatter radar waves across a wider range of frequencies compared to traditional stealth coatings, potentially making the F-35C significantly more difficult to detect by certain radar systems. The exact composition and application process of HVARP are closely guarded secrets, adding an air of intrigue to the F-35C's updated look. However, the implications of this new stealth technology are far-reaching. By enhancing the aircraft's stealth capabilities, HVARP could provide the F-35C with a critical tactical advantage in contested airspace, allowing it to operate undetected and deliver precision strikes against high-value targets. Moreover, the deployment of HVARP is seen as a proactive measure to counter evolving radar technologies used by potential adversaries. By staying ahead of the curve in stealth technology, the F-35C aims to maintain its edge in air superiority for years to come. Despite these advancements, there are still some unknowns surrounding HVARP. While its theoretical benefits are promising, its real-world effectiveness has yet to be fully tested. Additionally, questions remain about the long-term durability and maintenance requirements of this new coating. The use of radar-absorbing materials like HVARP can lead to heating issues due to energy absorption. Darker colors tend to absorb more heat, while lighter colors reflect it. Keeping the HVARP chrome coating could help manage heat absorption, reducing the risk of damage to the coating or the aircraft. While the primary focus of stealth technology is radar invisibility, visual camouflage remains important in certain situations. Darker shades blend better with nighttime environments, providing an added layer of concealment for the F-35C during nighttime operations. Interestingly, the pursuit of highly reflective coatings on these advanced fighter jets harkens back to a bygone era. During World War II, many Allied aircraft were left with their raw metallic finishes, not just out of necessity, but also as a bold statement of their presence in the skies. This practice has roots in World War I, where the famous Flying Circus Squadron, led by the legendary Red Baron, painted their aircraft in vivid colors to assert their dominance in aerial combat. This historical context adds depth to the evolution of warfare strategies, from the deliberate visibility of bright colors and reflective surfaces used to provoke and engage in direct combat, to the current emphasis on stealth and remaining undetected for as long as possible, it's a fascinating twist in the ongoing narrative of aviation history, where the past informs the present in unexpected ways. The evolution of military aircraft aesthetics is not merely a matter of appearance. It signifies a broader shift in aerial combat philosophy. While traditional tactics focused on visibility and direct confrontation, contemporary strategies prioritize stealth and surprise, akin to the tactics of ambush predators. The sleek, mirror-like coatings adorning modern jets serve a strategic purpose, extending beyond aesthetics. They are designed to enhance an aircraft's ability to blend into its surroundings, reducing its detectability by enemy radar and infrared search and track systems, thereby providing a crucial advantage in modern warfare. This seemingly simple design choice is, in reality, a sophisticated amalgamation of history, technology, and strategy, encapsulating the dynamic nature of military aviation. The chrome appearance of the F-35C represents a significant leap forward in naval aviation. Besides this, its stealth capabilities, advanced sensors, and powerful weapons make it a formidable opponent in modern warfare. The aircraft is expected to be the backbone of the U.S. Navy's carrier fleet for decades to come, playing a crucial role in maintaining American air power at sea. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and watch the next video as well. See you again.